Okay, female bodybuilders. What's this? Fit Magazine. Yeah, she's totally into, like, muscle and fitness. She's one of those people. Fitness program advanced three. Caloric intake, weight training preset. Last activity three days ago. Goals, goals, goals. Huh. Some people love that shit. Some people think that's hot. Like a, like a woman would uh, be into like bodybuilding, have muscles and shit. Well, what's this? Andrew Dagyab. Fitness program focus three. He also is doing weight training. The network specialist. I'll exercise when I'm dead. Haha, <laughs> calories you think not set. She doesn't exercise at all. That's pretty funny. So who else do I need the locker code for? Clive, the operation specialist, I need a locker code. <clears throat> Mild deficit caloric intake. She wants a cardio boost. She got a friggin' bra in here. What is this? Luster curl. Oh yes. The mechanical engineer. Cartwright orbital tools. Yes. Soy good chocolate bars. L Tacoma hat. She's weight bearing five. Custom plan. Roberta Williams. Ugh. Okay. I like that you can see their their uh their pictures on the door so you can recognize who they are. That's the Asian guy, yeah. So I need to find Clive's code. The Fury two one did another 20 bit series. Curious what other games I'm playing in the near future. Well, there's lots of new releases this month, including games like uh, Agents of Mayhem, um, Sonic Mania, the Uncharted expansion, uh, Mario Cross Rabbids, and Life is Strange Episode 2. All those are coming out. Well, not Episode 2, but, you know, the sequel or whatever. All those are coming out this month, so. So, where's Clive? Where the hell is he? He could be down here. Let me see something. Whoa. Where is this guy? The orange guy. Here we go. Oh, this is Roberta. This is the, the, the beefy chick. Okay. Inventory list. That's kind of boring. Personalized therapy with licensed practitioners. Licensed therapists. Huh. I'm trying to focus on the bright side with Nat. At least it pays well. I feel like I'm holding her back. She's up here on the ship posting because it's all I'm qualified for. She could be somewhere better. So it sounds like... Who's Nat? Nat is the network specialist, right? It sounds like her and Nat may be an item. And she's, she's mad, or not mad, but she's upset because... It sounds like Nat could have been doing a better job if she joined to be with her on the station. She feels like she's holding her back. Measures with Clive. Huh. Okay. Where's the other person? Yeah, see, that's Nat. Uh, all right, I gotta find this person to hack them now. Don't know where they are. Maybe down here? Clive's, here's Clive's office. Oh, here he is. <clears throat> Walked right into it. He's in a call with this guy. I'm gonna check that out in a second. A message from the Orbital Hospitality and Logistics. Remember your rights.
It's your legal right to, do, have, to celebrate obsolescence day no matter what your employer says. Because he's part of a union. The union's telling him you could celebrate no matter what. Huh. What is this now? A guide to be an inspired worker. Look at this. It looks like Fallout. It does look like the artwork, artwork from Fallout. Huh. Well, we don't have his locker combination yet. Maybe it's in his conversation? Or it could be in his room. <clears throat> Let's see if we can find it in the room. <clears throat> the lunar exterior. It's dark as hell in here. How do you turn this shit on? It's dark as fuck. Main lobby. Dude, that kind of looks like a, a Rapture, doesn't it? <clears throat> yeah, it looks like Rapture. He's got, what, an apple and gum in his drawer. That's it. Maybe his combination is at the workstation. There it is. 1407. Call Mother Evie's birthday coming up. Because remember, he's going out with Evie. Evie is the head of the station. Request special cat food. Don't slack off in the gym. And to cake decoration tutorial. 1407. <clears throat> Get this out of here. Shit. How do I close this? <clears throat> Seals coordinator. He, he applied to be the Venturis Belt Timeshare Sales Coordinator. He's trying to quit his current job and become a, a, a selling the timeshares out here. Where's he from? London. He's a Brit. A Brit. Okay. So 1407 is his locker. We're going to go back to open that up. It's a new log. I want to open his locker first, though. <clears throat> this way. Okay. What is this? It's him? He used to play football. A college per peak statistics. Oh, okay. So basically this is what he was in college and he's mad that he's not like that anymore. <clears throat> A key. Bunk drawer. Oh, shit. Okay. Let's go to his room. Where was it? This way. Alright, where's this drawer? Because this is his bunk. There it is. Softlets? The fuck are these? What the fuck is a softlet? Tissues. That's not important. Darling, I found these on shore leave uh, in a quaint Brighton Market stall. They brought to mind the color of your chestnut eyes, and then he wrote stupid. What the fuck? Open that back up. He bought her bracelets, but he never gave them to her. To her. Huh. Grab a letter. 
from two Clive Sadiq. Let me recover this so it'll stop bothering me, by the way. Get out of the fucking way. No, Germ, look, I just... <laughs> Pause. I'm trying to fucking read this. From Bernadette Sadiq. I write to congratulate you on your recent appointment to the Advisory Council of the Tate 20th Century. The Tate 20th Century? Your prestigious career in the arts has been constant inspiration to me. It says, Dear Mother. <laughs> to that end, I have continued exploring advancement both with inventurists and without. When I left Hilton after graduating Hilton U, I was so excited for the possibilities of Carnival. As you told me, then forging company loyalty for fickle opportunity is a fraught path. I've been working to claw my way back up ever since. And I'm trying to best every day. I promise to tell you more about Evelyn Victoria. She's the administrator of the station, and her wit and candor keep me constantly on my toes. And for what it's worth, I am deeply in love. I dare say she might well meet your approval. Perhaps our next short leave visit to the family estate is in order. So it was a letter from him to his mother. And what he's saying is, in the past he committed a crime. He tried to forge brand loyalty. Now, if you heard the other conversation from the Asian guy, his son... He's trying to get into college, apparently. And he was saying that you could get into college via brand loyalty, which is really weird. I guess in the future, they're saying corporations control everything, even the educational system. And if you have brand loyalty, you can get into college for free. Because remember, he said, we don't have enough loyalty, we'll have to pay. Huh. This is pretty weird. All right. Well, let's put that back then.